Hi guys, welcome back to another little geeky review. This time we are going to go through the fan favourite of Triclops recently just came out again for those that missed out on the first time. Now, the first time this is around, trying to even get this over the past few months, it was just completely stupid type of prices. But thanks to the whole shebang online store I have picked this one up recently for I think it was I think it was about 20 was it ish I think so but pretty much retail price so absolutely made up it is one of the ones from the first I think second waves that I just never ended up picking up it was this and web store that I missed out on and again the whole shebang got them through with them so yes this one fan favorite and on the front packaging in the top corner it has it there but triclops evil and sees everything it's still got the retro play i think the original one came with the um the glow in the dark ring i'm sure it did but I don't, I don't know, did the first release, drop the uh, comments in the box for us, did the first release come with the actual glow in the dark ring like it did do in the 80s? I'm not sure, but I don't think it comes with this one. On the back, it's got the usual cross cells there. And then the fan favourites, I think, for the release. So you've got another, the other main man. A new version of She-Ra. I haven't got She-Ra yet. So, I, well, I've got the original one there. With them funky old kneecaps going on. So I don't know whether I will get it. Maybe, maybe eventually. I don't know. Um, you got the Zodak there as well. And then the art. You've got them zapping uh, He-Man and... Battle Cat there at the bottom. It includes your comic book, but the little snapshots of Sino there screech up at the top there. Triclops, multiple vision modes, and optic uh, attacks make him a dangerous soldier in Skeletor's army. So let's crack this bad boy open and get a closer look at him. In the pack he comes with the usual removal and swap parts, so head, arms, hand, waist uh, and round the top of well, the boot and foot, cuff as well. And he comes with the sneak attack little camera, comic and we've got obviously this is the the US type of version I call them because they've got all the little speech bubbles in there telling you exactly what the story is about I don't think there's any change from it from the first release again you can pop those in the comments I'm sure it'll be the same comic book as it did come out first off I don't think they would have rehashed that in any way but here he is out of the box I mean I am just made up I didn't think I would ever end up getting Triclops not at the price we've got him at on the re-release because there was no way I was going to pay those secondary price type of charges I mean look at his outfit on there big pop green and orange absolutely cracker there's little va little eyeball thing going round let's just sort his head out so you've got the the angry red flip it round another little stain red one and then the good mood <laughs> type of thing with his little uh, blue eyeball with these the eyebrow itself or the eyelid would you call it so that's joined all up in one with the angry one he's got another little black turned in eyelid underneath but my blue one it's like two separate ones so I don't know whether there's like a bit of black paint 
that has not gone through that or it's meant to be two not too sure his armor is that flexi type of plastic and they've got those little clip-ons to secure it round the back his accessory green and uh, green and black so his big long sword and it has his holder stashed in the back of his armour there so he can carry it round with him and slide right the way down um, the the articulation is the exact same as all the others so his head is on the bobble so up and down twist left and right his arms do a 360 they splay out as well elbow joint wrist twist and on a little ball joint so it can flex back and forth twist 360 rotation on his waist leg splay out back and forth as well kneecap joint the ball joint on his ankle and it twists fully round I like that little uh, slip that it came with it tells you all the parts that actually pop off as well so the boot the waist the head the arm and also the hands with regards to the hands one splays out one's a gripper hand for that sword accessory to slot in there to give him a good stance as well I've just popped him on that one of them necker bases but yeah what are your thoughts on this guy did you pick him up first time round or have you recently got the re-release the fan favorite one is there any differences so let me know because like I say I never got the first release did he come with that glow in the dark ring like he did back in the 80s while you're there dropping them comments do the usual with like subscribe and tickle that little bell notification it really does help me out guys but thanks for checking in on this one and i will see you on the next take care